For me, the evolution of the tools started the moment I started putting the model to work, to practice it on problems. In 2020, we published the book Designing for Modern Learning. I had a choice of whether this would just become another book on a shelf or if I wanted to build a movement to empower people around the world to use it. Of course, as you all know, I chose the latter. As I started and grew LCD Group, we learned. My initial facilitators and consultants learned via our consulting projects and the really amazing questions we got from course participants. We tried ourselves doing persona interviews at scale and synthesizing the data. We reviewed existing assets and figured out what to improve and along what timeline. And we had the conversations with stakeholders that changed their perception from training as the automatic answer to us as business partners working on a learning challenge. As you'll hear from Lisa in a moment, we knew when we developed the track action in 2015 that that was the one that had the most space to grow and be developed further. Because back then, a single asset was all anyone did. Now, through LCD Group's work of building a movement for modern learning and the changes in general in the industry, we have a lot more data and insight to evolve the track action. So along with the track changes that you're going to see, the tools version two also reflect years of practice and really taking the model's concepts and making them actionable. It took a year of work to get here, but just like the book, it's been a really incredible journey that I know is going to keep on elevating our profession and building the movement towards modern learning. Now, You may not know it, but the new version exists because of feedback from many of you in the community. In uh, early 2021, uh, we conducted a survey of what LCD users loved and needed uh, beyond what we already had. And uh, we reported the results of that in an academic paper that was published. What we discovered was there was a lot to love in the LCD model, things we didn't even realize that people appreciated about it, uh, and it brought that to our awareness. But it also pointed out that our track action and track tool were very underutilized, hardly utilized at all. So I set out to change that. Uh, On that journey, I discovered that metrics and measures actually impact each and every one of the five actions. So Crystal and I committed to another year of work to upgrade all of the five tools. 